Hey guys, welcome. In this lecture, we are going to be able to get the name of the picked file. Okay, now assuming we picked an image, we are going to be able to get the, the name of the image, which is currently fresh to your JPG. And assuming we pick this, we want to be able to get the name of the picked image or the name of the picked file because you can also choose to pick a video so this is going to be uh, jesus film dot mp4 so this is basically what we want to do we want to be able to get the name of the picked file now to do this first of all we have to create a variable to store that name and you can see over here this is a test right it is a test so it's going to be a data type of string so we can just specify the type of variable it is a type of string and then we can call this file name and currently you can see we are not assigning this to any value so what we have to do is to say it can be null by adding a question mark over here okay and Within the set state, we can then call the variable phi name and it's going to be equal to the result. Right? Okay. Result. Remember the result variable basically have access to the picked image. So we can then say result and dot files then dot first. And this time around, this is going to be dot name to give us the name of the pix file or what the pix file was saved with and you can see currently if we picked this image so the name of this image is fresh to the jpg and if we picked this video the name of this video is jesus film seems cool so this is what we are basically doing to get the name of the pix file now use control and as to save and this is basically it